Hi, my name's Steve Ray from Makita UK and I'm here with UK Planet Tools to show you the DCU602 18 volt LXT wheelbarrow from Makita. So as you can see, it is an LXT machine, so it will take four 18 volt LXT batteries in the four different compartments, but it will only run off two at a time. There is a dead man switch here, so we can put it in the off position so we, no one else can use it when we're not using it. And then we can just click it back onto the on position when we're ready. That will then lock down and create a seal over the batteries so they're nice and protected. On the top of the unit, we have our battery indicator for both sets of batteries. We have our LED light on off switch, and then we've got our selector. So depending on what bank of batteries we want to use, we can use the selector on the top. We then have a little spirit level bubble on the top as well, just to give you an idea of what sort of level the ground is on that you're working with. And then to the right hand side, we have our up and down switch on there for when we we're using the automatic bucket tipping function, we can use that. On the left hand handlebar, we've got our lockable brake, which is disc brakes as well. So that is there in the park mode. And to release that, we can just push the top one and that will allow us to engage the motor now and use the machine. So when in park, we can just lock that one off. On the right hand side, we have our horn button. So to let anyone know we're coming, we can push that button to make people aware. We have our power on and off button on the machine. Now bear in mind, you can only turn this machine on and off if the disc brakes are in the park position. We then have our forward and reverse mode selector and our free speed selectors on the machine as well. We then have our accelerator trigger on the bottom. So when we do want the wheelbarrow to move, we can push that to start the motion. So on them free speeds, it goes from 1.5 kilometers an hour up to a maximum of five kilometers an hour. And then we've got up to one kilometer an hour in reverse. Also, when we do put it in the reverse mode, the beep will automatically sound so we know we're in reverse. On the side handles as well, they are fully adjustable and they're easy to do without tools. So there is two nuts on the side there. If we just loosen them, we can then raise or lower the arms to our specific height that we require. And on the back here as well, you can see there's two blue knobs. Now they are for the wobble control on the front of the machine. So if you unlock them, it will allow the machine to tilt as it's going over rough ground, always keeping the powered wheels on the deck so that it can always deliver power. If we're staying on a flat piece of land, for instance, we can lock them off so that it is just solid and in the upright position. So the capacities of the bucket of the machine are 300 kilograms of weight or 200 litres of heaped material or 100 litres of liquid material. The bucket itself will go 75 degrees on the automatic tilt, but if you wanted to do it manually, you can override that manually and go over to 110 degrees on the lift. With four six amp hour batteries in the machine, it will give us a runtime of up to 100 minutes of runtime. Also on the machine, just round the front, we do have our engagement for the motors. So with this red lever on the side here, that will disengage the motor from the wheels and allow us to free roam with the wheelbarrow. So if you don't want the powered motion, you can disengage it. To lock that back into the powered option, we can just slide that back over, clip that in, and now it will run off the forward and reverse. So that was the DCU602 18 volt LXT wheelbarrow from Makita. Available now on UK Planet Tools website. Thank you for watching.